All right, so we want to find the cosine of the inverse sine of negative root 3 over 2. So sine is bound between negative pi over 2 and pi over 2. And so negative square root of 3 over 2. The y component here, so this is equal to negative pi over 3. So if we take the cosine of negative pi over 3, well, it's going to be positive for, for cosine. But in this case, uh, we got 1, and then the hypotenuse is 2. So we end up with just one half. So again, no, that's not quite. It's negative root three, two, one. So we just get one half. All right. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching.